Welcome to my channel American Report subscribe to my channel for news updates all around the world. For more than half a century the skies above us have been dominated by a powerful duopoly, Boeing and Airbus. These two aerospace giants have shaped the way the world travels, setting the standards for safety, innovation, and global connectivity. Their rivalry has fueled decades of technological advancement, fierce competition, and iconic aircraft that have become household names. Whenever you step onto a long-haul flight, chances are, you're flying in a plane crafted by one of these two titans. Their aircraft connect continents carry millions of passengers every year and are trusted by airlines across the globe. But now, a new force is rising in the east. China's Comac C929. This ambitious wide-body jet is poised to disrupt the status quo, offering a fresh alternative to the established players. Air China's bold decision to become the launch customer for the C929 marks a pivotal moment in aviation history. It's more than just a business deal. It's a signal that the balance of power in the skies may be shifting. The C929 isn't just another aircraft. It stands as a symbol of China's determination to innovate, compete, and ultimately lead on the world stage. It represents years of research, investment, and a vision to challenge the established order. By choosing the C929 over proven models like the Boeing 787, Air China is making a powerful statement of national pride and confidence in homegrown technology. It's a move that could inspire other airlines to reconsider their own loyalties. This strategic decision has the potential to reshape the entire aviation landscape, challenging the long-standing dominance of Boeing and Airbus, and opening the door to new possibilities for airlines and passengers alike. The journey ahead for the C929 will not be easy. It faces technical hurdles, regulatory scrutiny, and the challenge of winning over skeptical airlines. Yet with Air China's unwavering support, the project gains both momentum and credibility on the world stage. The world can no longer afford to overlook the C929. Its arrival signals a new era in aviation. One where the question is no longer just Boeing or Airbus, but who will shape the future of flight for generations to come. The Comac C929 is the culmination of China's dream to build its own long-range, wide-body passenger jet. Designed to carry up to 440 passengers over 12,000 kilometers, it directly targets the Boeing 787 and Airbus A350. Originally a joint venture with Russia, the project became fully Chinese after Russia's exit. The C929 is central to China's Made in China 2025 initiative, aiming to master advanced manufacturing and reduce reliance on Western suppliers. Success would create a massive new industry, generate jobs, and foster a domestic aerospace ecosystem. Comac is finalizing the design and securing key supplier partnerships, moving steadily toward a late 2020s prototype. The C929 is more than a machine, it's China's declaration that it's ready to challenge the established order. Its mission, to offer a credible alternative to Boeing and Airbus, starting at home and expanding globally. Air China's decision to launch the C929 was a strategic move, signaling a bold step forward for the nation's aviation ambitions. This wasn't just about adding a new aircraft to the fleet, it was about taking a leadership role in shaping the future of Chinese aviation. The move is closely aligned with national policy, reflecting the government's push for technological self-reliance and global competitiveness in aerospace. By placing the first major order, Air China provides Comac with a vital customer base and a platform to prove the aircraft's capabilities. This early support is crucial for building confidence among other airlines, both domestically and internationally. This isn't just a commercial transaction, it's an investment in China's aerospace future. The partnership helps foster innovation, create high-tech jobs, and develop a skilled workforce for years to come. Backing a domestic alternative gives Chinese airlines leverage in negotiations with Boeing and Airbus. It introduces healthy competition, potentially lowering costs and increasing bargaining power for future deals. The C929 is designed to replace aging Airbus A330s, keeping investment and jobs within China. This shift ensures that more of the economic benefits from aviation stay at home, supporting local industries. This move strengthens the domestic aviation ecosystem, from manufacturing to maintenance, and encourages the growth of supporting industries such as parts suppliers and training centers. As launch customer, Air China can shape the C929's development to fit its needs, accelerating the aircraft's maturation. Their feedback will directly influence design tweaks, 
operational features, and even passenger experience. It's a blend of patriotism and business strategy. Air China isn't just buying a plane, it's helping build one. This collaboration sets a precedent for future projects and inspires national pride. This partnership secures Air China's place at the forefront of a new era in aviation, positioning the airline as a pioneer and innovator on the world stage. The C929 is a national mission, not just a new fleet. It represents China's determination to soar higher, with Air China leading the way. The Comac C929 versus the Boeing 787 Dreamliner is a classic Challenger versus Champion story, a true clash of aviation titans. On one side, Boeing's Dreamliner has set the standard for modern long-haul travel. On the other, the C929 represents China's bold ambition to break into the global market and challenge the established order. The 787 revolutionized aviation with its composite fuselage, fuel efficiency, and global support network. Its lightweight materials and advanced aerodynamics have made it a favorite among airlines seeking lower operating costs and greater reliability. The Dreamliner's success is built on decades of engineering expertise and a worldwide reputation for safety and performance. The C929 aims to match the 787's range and capacity, learning from its predecessor's innovations. Comac is leveraging international partnerships and the latest technology to close the gap, hoping to offer airlines a compelling alternative. The C929 is not just a new aircraft, it's a symbol of China's growing influence in aerospace. However, analysts expect the C929 to lag a generation behind in technology and efficiency, at least at first. There are concerns about the learning curve, certification hurdles, and the ability to deliver consistent quality at scale. The road ahead for Comac is filled with both promise and significant challenges. Its main advantage, competitive pricing and strategic value for Chinese airlines, could help it gain a foothold. For domestic carriers, the C929 offers a chance to reduce reliance on foreign manufacturers and support the nation's aviation ambitions. The 787's mature global support network is a major selling point. Comac must build this from scratch. Airlines value after-sales service, spare parts availability and technical support areas where Boeing has decades of experience and where Comac will need to prove itself. For airlines the choice is about trust and risk, the 787 is proven, the C929 is new and untested. Decision makers must weigh the benefits of innovation against the uncertainties of a new entrant. The C929 promises competition but comes with uncertainty and geopolitical risk. International acceptance, regulatory approval, and political tensions could all impact its success on the world stage. For now, the 787 remains the benchmark, setting the pace for innovation and reliability in the skies. The C929's challenge is to prove itself in the skies and in the market, earning the trust of airlines and passengers alike as it seeks to carve out its place in aviation history. In a surprising twist, major Western suppliers have joined the C929 project. At the Paris Air Show, Comac announced partnerships with France's Safran and America's Crane Aerospace and Electronics. Safran will provide key systems like crew oxygen, ice detection, and advanced braking. Crane will supply the aircraft's door signal system. These deals give the C929 access to proven, world-class technology, accelerating development and boosting credibility. Western involvement weaves the C929 into the global aerospace supply chain, making it harder to isolate. It also creates business incentives for Western governments to avoid harsh sanctions. Comac's strategy, build bridges with global suppliers, even as political tensions rise. The C929 is becoming a truly international project, despite the rivalry. The biggest question for the C929 is its engines. Originally, China planned to co-develop an engine with Russia, but that partnership ended. Now Comac must choose source engines from Western giants like GE or Rolls-Royce, or develop a domestic engine. Western engines offer proven performance, but come with political risks and export restrictions. A Chinese engine would ensure independence, but is likely to lag in efficiency and reliability for years. Developing a world-class jet engine is one of the toughest challenges in manufacturing. China's CJ2000 project is underway, but remains unproven. The engine decision will define the C929's competitiveness and market appeal. It's a choice between speed to market and technological sovereignty. The outcome will shape the C929's future and China's place in global aviation.
even a well-built C929 faces a massive obstacle international certification. Without approval from the FAA and ESA, the C929's market is limited to China and a few other countries. Certification is a rigorous, years-long process, especially for a new manufacturer like Comac. Geopolitical tensions add another layer of difficulty, as Western regulators may be slow to certify a direct competitor. Any safety incident could delay or derail approval. For now, the C929's primary market will be domestic, just like its sibling, the C919. International airlines will be cautious until the C929 proves itself over millions of safe flight hours. Overcoming this great wall of certification is the true test of the C929's global ambitions. Until then, its reach will be limited. Comac's strategy is clear. Focus on China first. The domestic market is huge and growing providing a captive customer base for the C929. State-owned airlines will be directed to buy the aircraft ensuring steady orders. Operating within China allows Comac to refine the C929 and build a robust support network. This approach helps work out early issues and build a track record of reliability. China becomes a proving ground, maturing the aircraft before any global push. The C929 is shielded from direct competition with Boeing and Airbus, giving it time to develop. By conquering its home market first, Comac lays the foundation for future global expansion. The patient, methodical approach is more likely to succeed than rushing into international competition. The C929's arrival marks the end of the Boeing Airbus duopoly. For the first time in decades, a new player with superpower backing is entering the wide-body market. This will force Boeing and Airbus to compete harder in China, the world's largest aviation market. The C929 gives China leverage, transforming it from a buyer to a strategic industry player. Globally, the C929's impact will be gradual, depending on certification and trust. Critics say it's a generation behind, but history shows today's followers can become tomorrow's leaders. The C929 signals a shift in global economic power and technological capability. Whether it becomes a global bestseller or a regional force, it has already changed the game. The skies are entering a new era, more crowded, more competitive, and more complex. A challenger from the East is here to stay.